She's within walking distance and um, I'm so excited guys. I'm literally so excited. I mean, you understand. <sighs> okay, I'll catch you later. Hey guys, so, she's so pretty outside. we're joined with uh, Ottawa Renu Me. We have got our McDonald's breakfast. <laughs> we ate that. We chowed that down. And now we're on our way. Yeah, Uxbridge, here we come. <laughs> So cute. Oh. I didn't, I didn't Silly baby. Mm -hmm. We are waiting to go to Focus 24. Oh. Yes. I'm excited. I'm excited to leave. Take and she talk to them. I'm excited to sleep. Take take what are you doing right now? I'm just going to buy my donuts. <laughs> <laughs> my mom does it. Julie, why do you always look like life is life in you? Uh, it, guys, life is life in you. Hey, man. But sometimes you have to move. Maybe I'm just in four, four more months. Yeah. Can you relax? It looks please? so nice though. Can you, you just rest? Ready. Can you never come anytime to do it. <laughs> Erica, baby. Um, hey, actually, you better cut me out of your blog. I'm not cutting you out of anything. Okay, guys, so we are on the coach currently, and I really hope you can hear me, but yeah. Oh, I was so tired. Really, is already. The girl is trying to see. I've got my headphones in. I'm ready to punk out too. Um, just thought I'd update you guys. And then, yeah, everyone's pretty much ready to see. And she's got her headphones in. <laughs> Julie <laughs> Strong. So then, I hope you can hear this. If not, then. Hello. Top speed. Yes, ma'am. What are you Top trying to speed. get? What are you getting? Are you getting? Oh, you're going to get this chicken. I'm done. Because I stopped between now and I know. That's it. Hi. Um, so, how much is a meal? Like, I don't really know how chopsticks works, but like... Yeah, one meal deal. Okay, yeah, can I get them... What does small look like? Oh, small. Can I get a medium, please? And then... Uh, can I get the rice, please? Sorry, hold on. Ooh, can I get the caramel drizzle chicken, please? Uh, I want three toppings, but I don't want large. So what do you recommend? Do you think I should just get large? Or, oh, okay, yeah, let's do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It makes more sense, thank you. More cost efficient, there we go. Guys, we're at a pit stop. The only pit stop we'll be at. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, so that's the only pit stop we're gonna be at. Um, can I also get the teriyaki beef, please? Um, so I'm getting some chopsticks. brunu has got her KFC tried and tested, tried and true. Um, and then can I also get a barbecue chicken, please? Yeah, I'm happy with my selection. I'm really, really happy, you know. I will not be sad. I will always. Hey guys, 
good. That will do it. Um, I'm just vlogging because this just feels so cool. Like, do you feel, just feel like a main character? Yeah. I feel like I'm in a movie. Um, yeah, we're about to eat some dinner. Is it good? We're about to eat some bin oh. bins. Some dinner. Fish and chips. Um, yeah, do you do this? No, no, we don't touch the camera ever. <laughs> We just had the worship session to kickstart off um, the retreat. We had a wow session, which is a, wi a word of wisdom by Samson. Um, what else did we do? And Mike was just giving his um, session essentially on the Christian um, Hellenism. So Christian Hellenism. And the mantra of the Christian Hellenist is... Let me get it up, because that what he ate with that. God is most glorified in me when I'm most satisfied in him. So, anywho, I'm not going to get into that. I can't lie to you. Um, I won't lie to you. I had to leave a little bit early just because I was wearing... I've been wearing contact lenses since 7 a.m. this morning. My eyes started getting dry, hay feverish, very irritable. I needed to wear my... I need to change in my contacts, wear my glasses put my hair up, just get myself a bit together. I don't want to eat something because I didn't like dinner that much. We had fish and chips and if you know me, you will never catch me eating fish and chips voluntarily. Like what? If it's not rice, why am I eating it? Anywho, um, yeah, so I'm just going to do that, recharge, then go back in. You're making all things new, so I will lay down my life and live for you. Sikirizakatonda Nenkula Yenjagaranga bisembera Sikiriza katonda nengola Yenjagaranga bisembera Sikiriza katonda nengola Yenjagaranga bisembera <coughs> Is that a cough? <laughs> Not y'all wishing bad on me and it's coming. <laughs> 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 this is what happens to people who love white people and hate people. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> to do you wickedness. I'm not even gonna give you a hate people tablet. If I'm tired now, like, I'm gonna make it yourself. But to know that this isn't a journey where I'm just gonna get more and more tired, but it's a journey where my desires and God's desires are gonna align. Yeah. I think that was the biggest thing for me. Um, mine was just like to stop fighting death and death of self. I feel like for me, um, for the longest time, I've been trying, I, I've been feeling like this walk is so personal and I'm giving up all of this stuff, and it, but it's, we're all going through it. So I guess when he was speaking, it made me realize like if he can recognize that from the age of 13, and it made me realize that it, I have to just like the process and ask God to help me like it mm -hmm. rather than trying to fight it and find how I can do both because it's just long. So. Yeah. The guy in purple in, in our room looks like he should, he should be a model, you know? Bro, that's why I grabbed no, him. No, genuinely. I to his brains. <laughs> I wanted to speak to him small. <laughs> I do your lie, I do your lie. Yeah. How are you? What is this I do? I do Flip seat, <laughs> so silly. As I'm with Reno Reno and Esther, and we are nice. seeing... And we are watching We're being mascots this. today. No, Give me like a. We don't like groupies right now. No, we don't. There ain't no groupies in Christ. Oh, amen. We're just supporting. We supporting our brothers in, in Christ. Christ. <laughs> they need us. Oh, that's hurting me. Guys. Sorry, girl. So guys, it's the end of day one. I'm literally ready for bed now. Everybody's pretty much in their beds, about to go to sleep. Um, it's been a great day. Great start to the week. Great start to the retreat and. Oh, there's so much I could say, but I just, I'm going to let the week do the talking and then I'll find some time to steal away and do more talking. But yeah, it's been great. I'm going to go to bed now. End of day one. Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday. We are currently on our prayer walk. And uh, yeah, 
starting the day off strong. Starting the day off very, very strong. You know when you just wake up, you've had a shower, you've done your skincare routine, and you just feel so ready for the day, so alive. That's what I'm currently experiencing with this content creator. <laughs> but yeah. So this is supposed to be a prayer walk, so I need to stop talking to y'all and go talk to him. I'll catch you later. Bye. I then we go into this period where everything seems good. I end up going to Canada and I'm on the phone with, and then um, I experience my dad basically choking. Um, like the, the fear of what they thought would be the trigger to how he would choke to death was happening on the phone. And that was a moment where I really was praying to the Lord in desperation, um, hoping that the Lord would save my father. And at least the, the one important thing, um, the cancer was of his larynx, to, so to always, to also to save his voice, because my dad is like a minister of the gospel, and so his voice mm. is something really important. Go on breakfast. What you got for me? Well, uh, well, don't come too close because you're a woman. Oh, yes. No, no women on our grounds. Please. Just throw it to, actually, throw it to you me. You want That's the bread? Weird. Yes. It's well refrigerated. <laughs> <laughs> well refrigerated. Why is your bread in the fridge? Coke. 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 I've never seen that before. Honestly, I just, bread you get it. You actually yeah. get it. Just like, Coke is the way. Oh, I might do a warm Ribena for my, you know, for my Coca Cola. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you're doing, like a warm, something warm. Hey guys, welcome to my crib. Yeah. We're in Wales. What is going on? I can't step any further. Exactly. I'm a woman. Boundaries. Boundaries. Oh. Yeah. Right done. there. Yes, yeah, so we're just going to have some so bread and some one... coke. Right. You know what? We've got a bit of hay fever. So we take things back to Nigeria. What are we doing in Nigeria? <laughs> you have to deal with it probably. Oh my gosh, are you Nigerian? Yeah. yeah. But your surname? Oh, yeah, yes. It's, it's, I'm, the, I'm a, what do you call it now? Oriental. So what tribe? I'm Igbo. Yay! You actually Igbo? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, man. Damn. Just you like see, you just. Oh. Oh yeah, you did say that. You did say that. Oh, this is great, girl. Is it? This is great. I have photos of everyone, but me. Let me get you. Me... Okay, girl. If he says you offer it, like, okay. Don't Bye. beg me. Don't beg me. <laughs> Don't beg me. <laughs> Hey guys, good morning. No, I don't like this. I don't like it. Oh, I love that transition. That was dope. Hey guys, so we're outside the Josiah Hyacinths. You know, what is this thing called? Chalet? Whatever it's called, yeah? Block out the Addy, block out the Addy. Anyways. Block out the Addy. Yeah, we're escorting him because you know he can't go anywhere on his own. I'm not an escort. That is not me. Wait. Wait, I'm, I'm, that is, there that. ain't no we in escorting. <laughs> Don't say that. It's all you, girl. We just had a morning prayer walk. It was great. Josiah shared, Josiah shared a great testimony. Mm. It was so powerful. So touching. It felt like a testimonial. It did. It really did. Yeah. Wow. I'm no, sorry, Renee. Look at the view behind you. Yeah. Goodness me. Wow. In this life, get out of the city. Yeah, when I saw city. that brown There's house for you in the city. planted on the hill, there were, bro, I said, I saw that, yeah. confirmed. And there's even one next to it. <laughs> said, Neb, you can't. <laughs> can. There's nothing for them in the city.
Get yourself embedded in community. That's where healing happens. As people bump up against you and go, hey, are you okay? I was praying for you this morning. I just want to encourage you. Keep going. God uses all of the body to put us back together. That's good. How do that in isolation? You don't know no one. No one knows you. You don't talk to no one. It's hard for you to move forward from that. Yeah. So it's so important for us. God, you can do what you say you can do. Third one, I am who you say I am. I, I am, am who you say I am. I always find this one a little bit tricky. You might have to swap. Uh, fourth one, I can do what you say I can do. I, I can, can do what you say I can do. Number five, your word is alive and active in me. Your, your word is alive and active in me. And last one, I believe God. I believe God. I do hear because this is actually where the seat of your heart is. Here. So when you, you feel it in your gut, mm. you know, when something happens and you're like, oh no, it's here. Yeah. It's not, this is your physical heart, but this is the heart of who you are. It's here in your gut. Um, uh, yeah, basically, guys. <laughs> we need a bit of them. No, I just touched it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no. Really, basically, no, just scared to race a scaredy cat. Scaredy cat. Scaredy oh, cat. I'm not even a nah, cool nah, nah, I'm not scared. She's a scaredy, scaredy cat. cat. Do you know why? Because God said we shouldn't fear and we shouldn't be scared. So don't be scared and go and run. I run. No, but he also says. He also says. He also says. He also. What did he say? Ain't quite there, no back top. Listen here. Go to go and prepare go yourself. Go to the second. Go to the second bullard. Yeah. Where I get if I beat Esther? I don't mind. Grace. If you beat Esther, we'll, we'll discover your price. Who's on us? You won't have to. Why are you lying? Who's on her? Who's on her? Us. Make sure you're not. Hey, whoever wins. No, look, look. If you beat, if, no. Whoever wins, then you have to. No, sorry, I don't have no money. <laughs> sorry. Yeah, yeah, that was your I don't have no money. Okay, oh, wait, if you win. Wait, though, wait. We have to assess. Okay. These ain't running shoes. If I can change, let me oh, put my Karachi's on. My, my, my Yeezy on. Let me put my oh, boost in. But yeah, you're, running, you're running from the second bullard to us. Okay, that's the second one. There's yeah. a whole lot of discussing. That's not that look. So you, you need boost. You need to be able to boost when you're running. <laughs> she said boost. You get like, you need a boost. From that first one to it's too short. It's true. Man, come on, you made me take everything off me. No, 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 no go now. You have to go to the bullet. I'm run from here. I'm run from the bullet. Okay. Wait. No, don't stop playing yet. This is not a competition. It's just some good friendly banter. No, it's a competition. No, you say Everything that is a competition. Everything's a competition. <laughs> that's the wins. We're not gonna hear. We won't hear the end of it. I won't say anything. I promise. How about that's my prize? If I win, I just won't say anything. I'll just. Are you sure about that? I promise you. I can. I can hold a promise. Yeah. My one's, my one's, that's that's one. All right. Cool. Are ready? Tired probably. Cause you know these things come off. You know these things come off. Do you know what I mean? We just need to. Oh my god! That is a very. That can be said for anything. Yes. Wait, 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 wait. Stop, wait, stop, wait, stop. Really, Oh, guys, come on. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. That was the time. This is the trip that Moses took up Mount Moriah to go and meet God. To run down and go back up. No, bring, because, bring, bring, and then when he came back down, his countenance changed. Let me tell you lots of it. Oh, you brought the guitar. Good oh, on you. Oh, it's bonfire time. <laughs> it's bonfire time. Bonfire time. <laughs> Is that nice? Look at my Is comrades. That nice? Is that nice? God will bless you. Thank you so much. Are you okay? Is that nice? His eyes like fire. Ooh, why is it beeping? Um, Rinu, is it too hot? <laughs> Step away. The lens said... Back it. Beep, 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 beep. Back it up. No way our lens has heat detectors. How would you get yours like that? Uh, I don't know, I zoomed in. I've zoomed in as well. So I will lay down my life and live for you. Sikiri zaka tonda nengkola. As the storm cries.
Oh. Cheek conversation with fellow brother. Cheek. <laughs> fellow brother. Fellow brother of Christ. Fellow oh. brother of Christ. Um, morning, guys. It is morning, morning. It's Wednesday and um, I'll renew. Look at this. Bro. Look Christ. at it. Guys, you're missing out on the view. This is phenomenal. Oh, wow. Wow. Renee's really feeling like a sheep today. You know when your eyelashes are too heavy, you can't even see the view. <laughs> Let me lift it for you. Thank you. <laughs> I've just seen a black line. Just hold, hold it like this. I've just seen a black line. <laughs> nah, you know I've really come off big lashes now. Like I, I want to take this rubbish off, man. I've really started to dislike them. <laughs> why? Why can I not see? No, these it's, ones are alright. It's got. A, it's like a yeah. black. I don't know what this is. But the thing uh, is, even with the small bruh, line... He's, he's got a deep voice. Yeah. His voice box just broke. Got some octave. Do some some bass. Bruh. As a male. Wow, I'm so still. Bleh. Yeah, that shit, that, that'll do it. That'll do it. <sighs> I told him, stop complaining. Don't you know it's bad to complain? Don't be discouraged. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like Randall's daughter. For real, for true. For true. Oh, I miss Rando. I can't wait to go back to church, man. I actually need to go back. For true, for true, for true. Oh, yeah, I do so miss Rando, man. All that, yeah. Wow. Wow. How are you feeling? Like that. Mmm. Just feeling like a, a lamb. Feeling like a lamb. Yeah. I feel so guarded. Guarded, like protected, like held. Hey, girl. Mm. We just wave to our team leader. <laughs> yeah. Mm. So protected. Like the sheep she they have. Me she also reminds me of Rumika, though. That's crazy. So weird. That's so crazy. I'm talking about nature, though, not about physicality. Mm. But, um. No, same. Come off it! Girl. Um, but yeah, no. That means your blood is sweet. I think. Really, very much just like. I'm not. I'm not limiting God down to. Um, hello, want to join the conversation? You want to join? Do you want to join? Yeah, yeah, you can join. You want to join? You can join the conversation. As long as you don't mind being on YouTube. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, for real? Yeah. yeah. Oh, no, sorry. Are you no, sure? No, join. No, sorry. Why? Why? Come on, we need perspective. No, we need okay. <sighs> it doesn't matter. We, you, okay, you sit just... there. When we're done, you can join. Then we'll... Just be the we'll, off, we'll off have camera one... voice. Yeah, off camera voice. Yeah. 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 You know what? I'll even turn it so that they can hear you as well. Yeah. You can stand behind the camera if you want, or you can sit. However you so choose. Thank you. Yeah, off camera voice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we just have one of those people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're just reflecting. And how we feel right now. Oh, how I'm midway through the distance. Hmm? Midway through the distance. What do you mean? The like halfway through the, the, the retreat. retreat. Yeah. 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 Oh, I didn't even realize it's the halfway point. How yeah. do you feel? How's the retreat been for you? Mm. It's been good, you know. I mm. feel like it's been very... Do you know when Michael said, like, we're just going to really flood you with stuff? Mm. And then you can take it home and yeah. assess it how you need to. Yes. I've really felt that. Like, it's been a lot, but it's been really yeah. good. Yeah, that's, that's what I was. Yeah, I mean, that's what I was thinking. Because so I felt like when you'd asked me earlier how I felt like this, you just mm. waking. I was struggling to say because it was like I'm not feeling right now. I'm just taking in. Mm -hmm. I feel like when I leave, mm -hmm. it will be a deep feeling. Process. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, okay, cool. But yeah, it's a lot. So though. It is a lot. Mm. How you find it networking and speaking with people? It's all right, you know. I think. I think, like, I can talk to people, mm. and people are really cool. Yeah. A lot of cool people here. Yeah. I'm not naturally, like, the most friendly person in the world. Yeah. Not in a bad way, but I'm not somebody yeah. that's, like, I just want to talk yeah, to so yeah, many people. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But people are cool, you know, I guess. Because mm. I came solo. Mm. Oh, the best way to do it. Mm. I think I was telling you this this morning. Yeah. So good. Came solo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Why? My friend told me about it, but okay. he never came. Yeah. He just said it was good. Thinking. Yeah. He just wow. said it was good, so I just thought, might as well. Yeah. How are you again? 24. And have you been in an environment like this before? Nah, never, you know. Okay, it's all, it's I all new to me. Wow. Hmm? I beg you come on camera. Come on? I beg you come on camera. Nah, right, well, I don't do content. But why not then? I don't do content. You don't have to do content. You just... Nah. <laughs> 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 
Sure enough. Yeah. Now, because right now we're in a pensive mood. Don't worry, when I'm ready to push, I'll just shove the camera in your face. Yeah. But somebody asked me, no, you know what it was? It was this morning when somebody asked, why did you come back? Right? Mm. I remember when somebody asked me that the first day I came here and I was thinking, oh, you know, fellowship or just to meet God. But then I realized it. I realized when everyone was speaking this morning during our morning reflection, I realized the reason I came back was because On Mission does it in a way that I've never experienced it before. And I, I was comparing it truthfully to um, what, uh, Holy Spirit, what's that thing called? What Upper Room would be like. In the sense of that's very, it's a very specific and targeted focus. This Ooh. is very, this is, this is a specific and targeted focus, but in a different way. Yeah. That's more prayer life, spiritual, like uh, deepening your, your, your awareness of spirituality and everything. This is more dealing with the heart matters. So that you can even be in a position to do that and do it that's correctly. That's kind of like fire. This kind of wind. Yes. That's beautiful. Yeah, that's how that I, I clocked it this morning. I was like, that's why I keep coming back because I couldn't put a I couldn't put verbiage to it. I couldn't put language to it because I know what I felt last year and I know it was a lot. It was it was literally this, but just in a different way. And I was like, that's what I'm coming back for. I just feel yeah. very raw right and now. And I think the more you've become like even the more you've reckoned with who you are. Mm and who God's called you to be and like just the things you like your own boundaries your own things mm. the more you've realized that you would like to be in environments where you can flourish and be and blossom and yeah. do whereas that environment wouldn't encourage wind-like behavior because mm. you wouldn't be able to up and leave That's in the middle true. or you wouldn't be able to yeah feel like a sheep you'd do you feel know what like Julie said this morning when we were getting changed what? she was like um she finds it difficult sometimes to worship in, a, in an environment that we worshipped in yesterday, in the sense of she's used to the KAC boom, 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 boom drums, oh, yeah. which feel like chanting, which feel like war, which is great because mm. there's that aspect of God, that's the God of war, but also he's also, he's also, he's also peace, he's also still, yeah. he's also the tranquil, he's also the sensitive. Oh my gosh. And she finds it hard to connect to that part because she's such a war, war, war yeah. type of thing, you and know? That Bro, you know yesterday the bonfire, I don't know if you guys realise, but mm. there was like different parts of the bonfire where like there's different things going on. Yeah. So on one side there was like the traditional chants, mm -hmm. then the other side was like the guitar playing which was really mellow. Yes. And then there was one side where people were just talking and then there was like, you could hear everything in the background. Yeah. And like as I made my way around the circle, I was like, I really do like the little mellow with the guitar yeah. and stuff like that. And it felt like just everyone reckoning with the version of God that they, that they feel are. most yeah. drawn to. Yeah. Because as I walked past, I was, I don't know, in first I, at first I started with like the chanting and the whole like Elohim, all of that stuff. Mm. But I thought this feels for me like I'm worshiping God, but I'm not connecting. So I'm yes. doing it because I know that this is a worship song. Yeah. And then the moment I got left, because I left not in pursuit of anything, just to, you know, have some me time, then I heard mm. their version. It was kind of like a Hillsong vibe, very much just, yeah. you don't have to belt your voice out. Mm. It's people yeah. were humming and stuff like that. So I enjoyed it that way. And then I came over to the conversation area and it was just nice. Yeah. But you wouldn't be able to do that. You wouldn't have variety. You don't. You know. Fire, 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 fire. Yeah, because it's only it's, there's only room for one space right now. You're warring for the nation. But right. Actually, sometimes we need to heal. Do you know what I was saying to my friend one time? Because okay. the way I grew up, it was very like like you said, fire, mm. or yeah. It's a lot of that, yeah, yeah, yeah. and that's important. Yeah. That is a key part of facts, like your prayer life, all that kind of yeah. stuff. There's also the element which is just. So say you're in a situation, sometimes you do need to pray and tongue mm. and fast yeah. and everything. Sometimes you do need to be still and know that he's God. Yeah. And I feel like in certain churches, you may not be able to experience both. Oh, yeah. It can just be yes. going to war or it can just be be still. Yeah. And you do need to have both of those because yeah. both of those are important. What do you guys think of um, recognising that what your church only does one? I think every church has that. Every church specializes or yeah. has like, they're very hyper-focused on a specific area. There's a church that, oh rather, every church has its own ministry in the sense that there's a church, let's say church A is focused on the ministry of healing. Church B is focused on prayer and discipleship. Church C is focused on, I don't know, fellowship. Like every church, I don't, I don't believe, because I remember having this conversation with Nashada, which is why at one point in her life, she was in a very teaching, like a church that taught her a lot. Then she needed a church that could steward her, her leadership skills, because she didn't have that at the teaching church. Like I think there's, I think, I don't know, I, don't, I could be wrong, but I don't know that any church has all. And so that being said, when it comes to, 
when it comes to leaving church mm. because you understand that there are aspects to God that this church isn't necessarily focusing on right mm. now that your the, the spirit in you and the spirit when you're speaking to God and whatnot mm. is navigating you towards this area is that church hopping because I feel like as we've had conversations I'm thinking to myself you know they say all of this thing you have to stay and all that the mm. don't serve two masters obviously we understood when we actually read it that that's not even what it's meant to be right but in a sense of like that feeling of I've got my home church I've got my fire 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 but it's very much wind right now mm. it's very much wind I clocked that and that's why I was like maybe that's why I've been stepping away a bit because I need wind right now I don't need fire but then I don't I don't I don't know what, what does that mean term- there's no navigation of that they just tell you nah stay in church do you know, I think I think churches should cater to all of it. Like yeah. you said, you're more likely to find somewhere that focuses on yeah. this type of this type of whatever. But I think one thing I realise is that even if it doesn't, you should probably still stay. Mm. But you need more than just the church to fill you up right. in that regard. That's why something like this right. is so good because uh. it's not you coming here. You don't need fire yeah. if you have so much fire in your church. You yeah. need wind, like you yeah. said. Right. So there's so much more to the Christian walk and than the things just that will the fill walls you. of your Sunday church. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Perhaps that's how you maintain the balance because on mission is there for that. Then they like they have spaces like this where you can exist in that space and get what you need, glean from it. Like Mike said, overwhelm us with the information and the tools we need to now take it back to where we're going, mm. as opposed to okay, I need to find another place on Sunday that does this. Mm. Because perhaps it's an invitation for the, with the Holy Spirit for you to cultivate the wind that you need with Him alone. Mm. Uh, exactly. Right, but it's making me laugh, so they're hearing it. Ah. Just look behind you. Oh, time. Oh. We have to go. Do we have to, we have to go? I don't know what time. Oh, yeah. oh 9.25. I think so. When does it start? Mm. We should have asked before we left. I have the schedule thing on my phone. Oh, okay. I'm saying look behind you. Look at the landscape. It's beautiful. Oh, yeah. I was That's thinking our view. that when we came. It's gorgeous. Tuesday. No, we're oh, Wednesday. God. Do you know what? Even when we came, I wasn't sure about because you know there's no signal. Mm. I know that jazz. I wasn't sure, but I'm liking it, you know. Yeah. Because it keeps me off my phone. Yeah. It's Sorry, nice I won't get it. Get you in it. Thank you. It's really nice to be disconnected, honestly. Why are you beeping? Mm. <laughs> ah, it's even beeping faster. Oh, I think I've got timer on. How do oh, I maybe. take that off? Oh, that's easy. I don't know how to do it, but it's it's an easy fix. How do I take that off? Go to menu and then play about with it. This one you have to figure out your own. And then nah, teach man, you. where's Josiah? <laughs> yeah. I have no idea. Oh, no. What would you do outside I can't of? Can't cost my team any more points. No, I, I, hear it, I hear What's it. Your What's your team again? Bonza. Bonza. Chris. My oh. name is my name is Chris. My team oh. is Bonza. Chris. 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 Ah, Bonz. Bonza. Really. 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 Why do you give people 10 different pronunciations? I'd like to navigate them on the ways not to. Oh, you're so irritating. Hey guys. Oh, so we just finished worship. That's number three. Oh yeah. We just finished worship. And um, we're having a talk uh, by Michael? No, Micah. Uh, the leader of Ramp Church, Manchester, I believe. If I'm not mistaken, but I can't lie to you, this is the time where I steal away and um, I have to go and take a nap. It's not even out of disrespect, but genuinely I've realised about this. This place is, um, it's really, really, whoa. It's really, really important for you to know when to steal away. Not just for you and God time, but also to rest. Like, no one's going to give you that rest, so you have to take it. Um... I'm gonna give myself maybe like 30 minutes and yeah. Through various conversations, retreat, blah, blah, blah. I think over the years I've changed and I think I found my point myself out of point maybe last year or two years ago, more in this some, some sacred secular device or like I think I've changed as a person, but even within that as well, I found that though I changed, so I'm not always rise and grind, I still define the things I did by this secular, um, sacred um, kind of context. And I did, and I weren't able to see God through like, 
the range of things I did. It was either like God just through like min any ministry stuff or like mm -hmm. Christian mm -hmm. things, and then everything else was kind of for my own pleasure. But no, like, I think the Bible we'll talk about Bible examples as well. Like we can glorify God through everything, eating, drinking, our work as well could all be forms of glorifying God. Now baptize in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> It's not that like there isn't space to pour, it's just that my heart is a bit hardened. Mm. And the hardening is because this is the first time in like my entire life that I've done anything orientated with Christ in summer. Like I've always been outside last year, that's like up until last October. So in that moment I left the class and I just stood outside and started crying because it was just heavy. And then I remember getting a text from my friend Esther. Um, saying, am I okay? And in that moment, the Lord told me not to reply. And I was wondering why. And he made it He made it abundantly clear that he's got me first yeah. in that moment. And so I took upon myself to take that minute to talk to him and finally, for the first time, discover him as my lover. Yeah. And so um, because of that moment, when all of the first ones finished, I was saying to the Lord, like, oh, I would have loved to do that. This feels like a burden if I don't. And then you said this chance for other people. So, yeah, I'm doing this because he showed me in that moment that because he's got me in the quiet times, I have to have him in the public. So, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Do you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Saviour? Yeah, I do. On profession of your faith in Him, we now baptise you in the name of the Father, Thank you, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Oh, 
like, yes, I'll come back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> Be serious. As you can tell, not used to this. <laughs> We're not used to being in front of the camera, but oh. Ness has left us yeah, with the camera. I'm um, very fortunate, actually. Very fortunate. Is that no boy? That should be jealous. But we're about to have a McDonald's feed. It's been a beautiful day. I'll show you a seat in. All of these things, in the final analysis of everything, all we can just really do is go and I'll cast myself for you. But you see, that was response. He would never. Uh, I think he said, Shamrock, we rock. All Christ, holy, all Christ has solid rock, we stand Shamrock. Like, oh, Shamrock, oh. we rock. All Christ has solid rock, we rock. All Christ has solid rock. All Christ has solid rock. This rock is not Alright, we, we have to be vicious because I've been yeah, yeah, yeah. a little friendly. Kill or keep? <laughs> Kill. Uh, Kill. Let's go. Shamrock, right, don't stop. Uh, I'm the front, not the head to the top. Shamrock, right, don't stop. Let's go. Hi guys, it is currently um, Thursday. It's our last full day at the retreat. So day four and right now, and this is what always tends to happen. Like you don't really feel the fact that it's the last day. It's the last full day. Cause there's still, it's only 1240. There's still so much to do, so much to get through. But at the same time, it's getting kind of real, you know? Um, we're doing our testimonies from our baptisms. I got baptized yesterday, guys. I didn't, I didn't plan on doing that. Genuinely, it wasn't an, a plan. I was going to wait until, um, I was at my home church. I was going to, you know, just have family that like, uh, kind of just how it is, you know, um, how it's typically done. But in that moment, I can't deny the tug I felt to do it. Um, all the people who had already gone up for their baptisms had gone, right? Like they've done it. And then they opened the floor up. If anyone wants to get baptized today and you're feeling like it's something that's on your heart, just do it. If you're considering whether or not you should, then the answer is you should. So then I thought about that and I, I just kept, like I felt, I felt convicted. I felt like I needed to do it in that moment. So I went ahead and I did. And um, I'm just so glad I did it because I, I know the work that God is God has done and is doing in me. And that almost felt like a sealant. I don't know if you know about getting your lashes done, but once you finish getting your lashes done, your lash tech is typically supposed to add a sealant. It's a liquid that seals everything. It it, um, it solidifies and it covers everything that's already been done so that your lashes last longer, essentially. Of course, you could do it without the sealant, but your lashes typically last longer and um, it just acts as a protective barrier for your natural lashes as well, um, if done properly. So anywho, all that just to say, I needed to do that. I needed to do it. And um, of course I'm recording this now, but I'm not gonna post it until maybe for the next like two weeks. And I haven't told anyone yet. I haven't told, um, just because it literally just happened yesterday. And I kinda wanna just, I wanna, like I wanna experience it right now. Like I want it to be my thing right now. Of course I'm gonna tell family. I can't wait to tell my mum about it when I get home. I cannot wait. I look forward to telling her about that first. Um, but aside from that, it's whoever was here, you know? Um, yeah, don't ignore the tugging because God is, God is, he's pulling that invisible string of your heart, you know? Don't ignore it. If you feel that tugging and you know what it's for, you know exactly what the, the Holy Spirit is asking you to do. Just do it, just do it. Be obedient now, ask questions later. I'm literally taking a break, a much needed break. Um, we're actually right now in a seminar, but um, they called us out to do our testimonies for our, our um, baptism. And when I finished it, cause I was, honestly, I was almost falling asleep in that seminar because 
the, the environment is so warm, you're sat down, you're listening, and then we're already tired from like the night before and the days that we haven't really slept as much. So it, the tiredness kicks in. I just needed to eat and do something. Um, so I took this moment to steal away and just do that. I'm about to watch The Chosen. Episode seven of season four. Um, while I eat my food, I'm excited. Your name is a lie that the shadow can deny. Mm-hmm. Sometimes it almost feels like I was uplifting myself, that people could know me, I like my network could increase, you know. So it was that big divide of is it me that I'm growing or is it God, you know. Thank you. Thank you. So we're just going to play a few games. We're going to play three games. And so as a team, I need you right now to decide who the three game players are going to be. Question number one. On the back of our t-shirts, the merch, we translated Joy to the Greek. Oh, you know this. Team Shamrock is, is not looking too good right now. No. I do have a lot of faith in my in my group. I have a lot of faith in my team. Yeah, we've got this. We've got this. I don't know how, but we got this. We've got this. Do you want to redo that match? No, we don't. So can we just count the points? Shamboska, Shamis. Yeah. We're about to get a really cool shot. I can't wait. This is the relay race. So uh, Gabby's on the wheels. deliberating right now can't lie ivy kind of ate that they ate that they did the big one say well done because there was rhythm in that rhythm that if the ringtone started blaring out on the train station <laughs> Step to us, step to us, step to us, 
I don't want to step to you. <laughs> you had the answer. However, the first part just doesn't make sense. Not only is NIV a, a contestable translation. <laughs> To the world. I still can't hear you. I should not envisage myself doing this. <laughs> this is, I feel like serious fish out of water in this whole business. Because dancing, that's not really my thing. Chanting. I'm, anyway, here's my thoughts. I was enthusiastic. And it was, a lot of work went into it. I don't know what the chart means. <laughs> But maybe that's not that important. I don't know. I mean, oh, it's important. It's important. It's important. It's more than important. It's because I don't know what I'm doing anyway. I, I think my overall impression was I was quite in favour of it and quite warming to you, uh, but I then a couple of people got right in my face and I felt slightly. No. Yeah. 
my years of judging. Uh -huh. yeah. Prophesy. This is the most progress I've seen. Yeah. 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 You lost, yeah. And I'm determined yeah. to help you first. 50 hours. Woo! finding God in the mundane and I think we were asked about practical steps as to what we can take after this. I think for me I'm so used to enjoying God through formal Christian activities or our Christian disciplines, our prayers, our Bible studies, our fasting, that's fasting is not enjoyable but like you get what I mean as to those formal things but I think going back like even um, I was telling these guys how like I'm going to be really intentional about seeing like my time with the man them let's say we go theatre, we go play ball, like, all of that is enjoying God. 
all of that is joy like I can see God in this like if I'm sharing a meal with someone like I can see God through that and I think that's very good for like developing a God consciousness mm -hmm. and also you knowing that this is actively worship Romans 12 it's like our whole lives is worship yeah. it's not just our prayer and fasting but it's like everything Jay, last day, how you feeling? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling honest, honestly. I never thought I would make it. You can see from my voice, I'm trying myself. You did. What do you want to say to Kevin Lee? Kevin Lee, you do well. I will see you again next year. Last day, how you feeling? Feeling very tired. Yeah, I'm what's your these but eight when, you, when you get onto that coach, what's your plan? Guess what? They got bamboos by a bamboo. Remove yourself. Maple! You get bamboos by a bamboo! Terrible. Terrible. Hey, but look, we might have been terrible, but when did we come? How are you feeling? Something small for the boys. I'm fresh. How am I feeling? I'm yeah. good, man. I met you guys. I feel I'm happy. I'm meant to be I feel grateful for you. And I feel perfect now. Don't worry. Perfect timing. God's perfect timing. I know, but it's really, really is amazing. Oh, God gave it to Amazing. Oh. I had a great time, and hopefully we're back next year. Amen. Oh, where are those at? Where are those at? Oh God, this song. Oh God, this song. Yeah. How I feel, yeah. Yeah. Well, I feel happy. Mm. I feel graceful. Yeah. And I feel That's good. That's happy good. Because I know we're spending it. Ah. But God give business me business question. Ah. <laughs> I will translate, don't worry, I understand. Okay, translate, translate. She's saying that. She's chewing now. I can see she's saying that. So, she's telling me now that the week she had, it was amazing. It was amazing. She's fulfilled. Everything, her body's in pain though. And she's like, ah, see the pain. Look at the winching on the face. So, I just said that, thank God we went from Monday to Friday. We experienced him. She experienced him. Um, yeah. And now we go home. Now we go home. Yeah. Okay. Ah, there so we go. Wow! This is infidelity. Sorry, she has a dog. She's not allowed to do that. Hey guys, so we are currently. Oh, okay. This is YouTuber. Okay. Okay. You take the camera, don't you? No. Don't take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Okay. Guys, so we're currently at the pit stop. Yeah. As you can see, we're currently buying some KFC right now. Yes, my voice is like this because I was singing and shouting for the Lord. Okay, it's a little joke. Okay, not too much in the voice now, not too much. But yeah, people are just like getting yeah, their food yeah, and um, yeah. the bus driver's being a bit mean. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, come on, we're stopping. We're stopping. gonna be going back to England soon, man. Yeah. Come on, yeah. watch your space, man. Watch your space. Watch the spice. Um, what's Shamra, your name? Shamra, uh, Hura, Shamra, Hura, Hura. I was talking about how the bus driver is a bit mean. He said we have 15 minutes. What does this mean? Do you think I can pee in 15 minutes and get food? Ah. Impossible. can't. No, you impossible. It's impossible. can't. But yeah. For you, the notion. You don't need us. For you, the notion. Because my voice is actually good. <laughs> but it's all good, though. Esther does this. The camera is heavy. The camera is heavy. It's heavy. But yeah, I don't know who else wants to be in the vlog. But nobody else wants to be in the vlog but me. Me and only. But yeah, my name is Gabrielle and it's just so nice to meet you. Oh. Uh, I hope to see you soon again and again. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I literally just woke up as well. So this is really rough. Oh, damn. You thought we lost. But you don't know Shamrock. <laughs> the first to be the last in my <laughs> Maple! Yeah. You get bamboos by bamboo. <laughs> That's so cheeky. I will never forget that day in my life. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Hey guys, so we have come to the end of this week's vlog. 
it's been a week, hasn't it? A lot to digest. Honestly, I'm speaking to you right now from the space of having not digested, but I'm also coming to the understanding that processing is not, is not something you can put a time frame on. Processing looks like a year from said event, you're still recollecting, still seeing the manifestation of how God's hand was on a thing, in a thing. Um, you're still making reference to it in conversations because I can say the same of last year's retreat. I still reference it because there are things that happened and were established that are still showing fruit, still bringing forth fruit to this day. So yeah, um, I'm, I'm being a lot candid to myself in the sense of not bullying myself into processing because processing looks like living the everyday and God bringing back to remembrance things that had happened during this week, right? And um, really showing me his heart towards it and his mind towards it. Um, yeah, so here we are. Oh, guys. Yeah, so that, yeah. anyways. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss when a new video is uploaded. Um, again, huge apologies for the delay, but y'all, you can see the fruit, okay? I needed that break. But yeah, I look forward to seeing you in the next one, in the next video. Oh, my voice is still a little bit raspy. You know when you're at a point where, sorry, <laughs> I digress, but okay, I kind of want this to be my permanent state everything sounds better when your voice is raspy anyway that's enough for me bye